about age gap dating. Mm -hmm. What's your thoughts on that? My thoughts? Mm -hmm. It's out there. It's happening. It's real. Right. I, if it wasn't real, sugar daddies wouldn't exist. Sugar mamas wouldn't exist. So in 2024, I made a video talking about this is the way of the future. You're going to see age gap dating. Mm -hmm. um, it's going to be now out in the public more than ever. Yeah, it's already on the rise. It's already on the rise. <clears throat> um, you see a couple of stories in the media. Let's talk about one. Let's talk about the um, the Dre and Michelle incident. She what? she Her forty. Yeah, she forty. So it came out that she's pregnant by um, Jalen Green, the Rockets player. Yeah, he twenty one, twenty two. Yeah. What's your thoughts on that? I don't give a crap who people date nowadays, but mm -hmm. apparently in this generation, it's mm -hmm. a big deal. I also believe along with the increase of age gap dating, you will see now more interracial couples. When I mean by interracial, I mean by, I mean, it's already out there happening. It's you just like, but people, people, it's touch and go with that subject. I feel like it, it's happening more now because people, especially the black community, mm -hmm. they date within the black community, mm -hmm. especially women though. Mm -hmm. You date within the black community, they've been dating black men, they're like, I'm having no luck with black women, black men, and then they start to date outside of the race. First, a, a white man or Asian, any any other race outside the black. But I'll go back to the age gap dating. <clears throat> uh, I've been seeing a lot of comments on TikTok, IG, of men who are dating younger. Right. And they get a lot of heat. But right. if a woman's dating... Mm -hmm. If she's older, she's dating mm -hmm. younger, it's not as much heat. Why do you think men get so much um, heat, <coughs> get so much um, hate for dating younger women? Why do you think women... But I notice especially in the black community, older men get destroyed when they date a younger woman. But why in general do you think women hate seeing older men with younger women? I'm going off assumptions. Mm -hmm. I would assume it is because... That word grooming is thrown around. Right. Grooming. A man, I'll uh, throw out 42, mm -hmm. dating an 18-year-old or 21-year-old. They That word grooming is thrown around because I guess <clears throat> at a man or anybody, they think like if you, the younger you date, the easier it is to train that person, groom them into in them to be who you want them to be. Right. That's what I think. Mm -hmm. Why like men get more uh, hate on it than women? It's a double standard. Well, in my opinion, <clears throat> I believe that a lot of women think that. Like, what do you think? Do you think that younger women have no idea what they're doing? Especially in this day and age with social media and, and and all and and the phone like showing you all these different ways of getting money. Do you really think that younger women are naive to the game of of, of like, okay, I'm going to deal with an older man. I know he got money. I don't think they're naive, but mm -hmm. when you are as young as 18, you have not experienced life. You haven't, I mean, I'm going to assume you haven't had very many dating partners right. because before you're 18, you're 17. So that, if you're 17 dating mm -hmm. a 40 year old, we got to talk. So right. Right. I'm going to assume at 18, you don't have much experience in life. And I don't think they're naive. Um, they're naive to the fact that, like, you don't really know what you're doing. You don't really know who you you could be dated. Like, date multiple people. Don't just. It's, 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 it's hard to talk about because I can't speak on behalf of it because I've never dated that old. I don't want to say that old, but, like, I haven't dated with that Big of an age. Do you think that women, there's women, <clears throat> like younger women that date older men, do you think that they're doing it for money? Or you got this, do you actually think there's younger women who are actually attracted to older men? There's a small percentage of women who actually think that the older guy that they're talking to is attractive. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, though, I think that the younger woman who is talking to the older man is because he has money. Most of the time, the, that age gap dating, the man mm -hmm. has money right. most of the time. Like, I'm pretty sure, eighty percent of the time. All right, give me, but give give me like a give me a number, <clears throat> give me a number of age gap that's that you think is appropriate. I don't want to speak on that because who am I to say what 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 age just, gap? Just is throw something out there. You just said forty some dating an eighteen year old. I would agree that's a little extreme. I think that's very extreme. That's very extreme. Now that I will say is extreme. So give me one that you think like let's it's say appropriate. 
No, I, I don't think I don't I don't think forty and eighteen is appropriate. I know you want me to give you one. Give that's me one that you think is appropriate. One that I think is appropriate. Twenty one thirty one is appropriate. Ah, wait. Twenty one twenty seven is appropriate. Twenty five is appropriate. Mm-hmm. Twenty five thirty five. Mm. That's appropriate. So ten year max. Ten year max, but notice like when I when it got over like thirty, mm-hmm. I, I increased in the like age of the other person. So right. thirty five, twenty five. Mm-hmm. I didn't say thirty five, twenty. Okay. I didn't say thirty five, eighteen. When mm-hmm. he got older in age, I kind of increased the woman's age too. So if he's forty, I say the woman got at least at least thirty. I know there's forty year old men dating twenty six, but I say. 40. So so let let's talk about this. <coughs> a lot of women talk about they want a man who can provide and protect, and take care, of, pay the bills. Yes. Let's say you're a twenty six year old woman. How many twenty six year old men are able to do that? A lot. Where? They're out there. Really? That can pay a hundred percent. Yeah. I doubt it. In this climate. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Let's say they can do that. How many of them are actually faithful? So you think the older they are, the more faithful they are? I believe so. I think older men are kind of like out of that phase of trying to hook up with different women. Majority. I'm not saying all of them. Some of them still want to have multiple women. How many um, young guys who got money, 21 to 25-year-old men who got money are faithful to one woman? Now, if you're okay, if you're okay with being in like one of the other, one of the many chicks, that's that's on you. What I'm just age saying, range did you say? A young man, 21 to 26, who got a bag. How many of them are actually faithful to so one woman? So 21 through 26, you usually graduate college what 21, 22. Mm-hmm. So <clears throat> why are we seeing a lot of men who get married out of college? Who? A lot. I don't see it a lot. Wow, you don't see it? I don't. It's, it's usually it's typically be white people. Okay. It, and how many of those relations are successful? I'm not talking about the ending rate. I'm mm-hmm. just talking about like you said, where like you think they expect them to be faithful. Mm-hmm. They yeah, get I'm married. About, I'm talking about now. It's how, happening now. The, I really went to my high school reunion a couple years ago, mm-hmm. and a lot of the girls in my class and a lot of the men in my class were married. And wait, hold on. Is he paying all the bills? How am I supposed to know all that? I'm just saying. I'm that's just a, saying. that's another that's a thing. A lot of women talk about they want a man who could pay all the bills and be a protector. They don't want to do 50-50. I'm pretty sure they are because the school I went to, it's a private school. I'll just say it like that. And the women at that school, they literally live to be housewives. That's my point. So I'm pretty sure they're paying. Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Just because when I was in high school, I would hear the stories. I just want to be a housewife. I just want to cook clean. I'll go to college. I'll get my degree. And I even had one girl, kid you not, at the high school reunion, she was talking to this guy in college. And then, but there was a guy that was pursuing her, and he was a baseball player in the college at the time. She didn't give a crap about him. Mm -hmm. Then, then, like, I guess towards the C, his uh, final year in college, whatever, I don't know the timeline exactly, but he got drafted to go to the MLB. Mm-hmm. That day she gave him the time of day, and now they're engaged. And now she's out. Well, boy. he's definitely a fool. He is a fool. He's a simp. He is a simp. For because that. how dare you allow a woman to spin the block once you make I it. I agree. And then, you, and then she want to give you a chance once you make it. I agree. That's terrible. <clears throat> That's sad. But I'm 